You work here as a fisherman? All day long and all evening too. At night, I sometimes get a little sleep. Anything else? I don't get around to anything else. I rack my bones and I have so much work I don't know if I'm coming or going. Do you need help? All of these fish barrels have to be taken to the mill. Someone has to collect the barrels and take them over there. Where is the mill? Follow the river to the north. You'll find it there. Show me your goods. I'm gonna take a break. Hey, who are you? My name is Hatlod. I am the local shipbuilder, or rather, I used to be. Used to be? What went wrong? Well, look around you. Those filthy orcs have destroyed my entire business. And on top of that, <sighs> I lost my tools. But you have lots of tools left here. That's not the same. My great-grandfather worked with those tools. Damned old ruins! What exactly happened to your tools? It was like this. I took my new boat out on a test run, and suddenly there's a crash, and my boat is history. All I could do was get to dry land. And where do your tools come into this? I had them with me. As I said, I was testing my boat. There were two beasts that almost ripped me to pieces. I threw the tools at them, barely managed to get away. Tell me about these creatures. One was a lurker. Nasty things, those. Better beware of their claws. And the other one? That was a lizard. Man, I was lucky to have my tools. I tossed the tools right into their open jaws. And now, here I am, with nothing left at all. Too bad I'm so busy with my new boat or I would... What? <sighs> I see. Not the bravest soul, are you? I'm a shipbuilder, not a sword fighter. If I were a warrior, I would fight in the arena. What do you think of the orcs? Bunch of vermin they are. I hope they get what they deserve. But I shouldn't say that out loud. I leave them in peace, and they don't bother me. It's just that the demand for boats is no longer there. The orcs no longer allow any large-scale ship construction. Why is that? How should I know? Your grandfather? Yeah, a right old swashbuckler he was. Came from the Southern Islands. He settled here and brought the art of shipbuilding with him. He had his tools from the Southern Islands. They are truly a joy to work with. What ruins? Say, are you blind? Look over there by the lake. Those huge broken walls. That used to be an old stronghold of the Paladins. Then some people in Trellis dammed up the river towards the sea. Must have been a bunch of crazy mages. And whoosh, there went the castle. Oh, man, we laughed our heads off when those tin buckets started crawling out of the new lake. And now the remnants of the castle pose a hazard for all vessels. Quite a few boats went down after they hit those ruins. What became of the paladins? <laughs> they were mad as wet hens. The king let them have the castle near Gotha. I've no idea what became of them. All right. I will fetch you the tools. Excellent. Let me know once you've got them. What's in it for me? I think I have some gold coins left somewhere. Where can I find the tools? Hmm, good question. I would start looking around the lake. The two beasts that attacked me must still look around there somewhere. I hope they choke to death on my tools.
I'm sure you have Don't something bother. else to do. time. I'm on guard duty. Everything all right? I've been standing here for days. I'm hungry. I want some roasted meat. Five pieces. I've got some roast meat for you. Give here. Here's some gold for you. Not like, not like, not like that. That won't do anything. Not like that. How's it going? Miserable. What's wrong with you? Fish, fish. Nothing but fish. I'm headed up to here with those stinky things. How's the fish business? Exhausting. We're fishing like mad here. Caravans are constantly coming by and taking the smelly things away. You can barely keep up. Is that your arena? You want to fight, Mora? Hmm. Let me fight in your arena. Go and fight! Jarek is expecting you. No one beats me, <sighs> Mora. <sighs> Nothing to be had. You were lucky, Mora. Stop it right now. Stop right there. Get you after all. Gotcha. <laughs> now you are mine.
I think I want to hear this. There you are again. Come here. Stop where you are, Mora. Good. Well fought, Mora. It was child's play. Give me a good fighter. That is Gerald. He is good. Go and fight him. No one beat me. <clears throat> there is a fight. <clears throat> Who is your best fighter? <laughs> a blowhard! We just love those. Trumpock will split your skull if you challenge him. Wait and see. Damn! You are good, Mora. Give me your best fighter. You want Trumpock? You'll get Trumpock. Enter the arena! He'll be waiting for you. Now you can show what you're worth, Mora. That was one of the best fights we've ever seen here. You know your trade, Mora. Who's in charge here in town? Umbrak is our leader, but I don't know if he has time for you. He is always very busy. Maybe you should talk to the town shaman first. His name is Grumple. He's the right hand of Warlord Umbrak. I see. Orcs will kill all of you! I see. Who's in charge here? Umbrock. He is the lord here. Where can I find your lord? Umbrock is in the big house. What should I know about your lord? Go see Grumple the shaman. He can tell you. 
You're not exactly the brightest light, are you? You need torches, Mora? Never mind. Hi. Ah, uh, I know you. I have met you before. Mm, not that I know of. In my dreams, you were alone and fighting. In my dreams, you were alone and fighting. What else do you know about me? Your future is unclear. Many decisions lie before you. You are different from the other Moras. You are important. Could you elaborate a bit? Hush! Your story has not yet been written. Therefore, I cannot see it. Who's the boss here? Umbrak, the great warlord. The legends of his deeds are known far and wide. And where can I find this great warlord? His throne stands in the highest building of this town, stranger. What's your job here? I serve our leader with my wisdom and clairvoyance. I see. So you're his advisor. I am looking for Zardis. You have a long journey ahead of you then. His tower is in Nordmar, far off to the east. Teach me your knowledge. Hmm. Amora interested in the wisdom of the shamans. I must admit that I find that somewhat intriguing. Fine. I will teach you if Umbrak, our great commander, agrees to meet you. If Umbrak respects you, so will I. I see. Show me your goods. Stop using magic, Mora. Here it says something about alchemy. Another layabout in my kitchen. You're the cook here? Stop yanking my chain and get out. I'm busy. Anything else? Oh, shut up. I need raw meat. Fifty joints. What? You can't imagine how much these apes can fit in their stomachs, kid. Go and get me some raw meat. I brought you some meat. I need more. Get more. Why can't you be more relaxed? If I don't work hard, they'll chop off my head. So help me. Get lost. Just don't stand in my way. I need some peace and quiet. Don't even think about stealing from me, understand? Says who? Sorry, I'm just a little edgy. What's a guy like you doing in a place like this? What's your job in this backwater place? It's not like there's much to do here. I'm just hanging out with the other mercenaries, waiting for something to happen. You're a mercenary for the orcs, and you have nothing to do? I'm sure I do. Recapture runaway slaves. It's hard work trying to find someone hiding in those dense forests out there. You're not so keen on recapturing the slaves, are you? Those poor beggars barely have a chance of surviving in the woods anyway. Does slave hunting pay well here? Much too well. We mercenaries almost fight each other for the privilege. We even let some of the slaves loose on purpose so that we can collect their bounty later. You mercenaries are helping slaves escape? You never heard me say this, understand? If the orcs get wind of this, we're dog meat. What do you know about this town? Sildan lies near the pass to Nordmar. When the war started, the orcs came over the mountains from the northeast. That's why Sildan was the first town to be overrun and captured. Since that day, there have been no more major battles here. Who rules this city? Umbrak, 
During the war, he was a great commander of the Orcs. Grumpel, the city shaman, is his right hand. Umbrock will do nothing without consulting him first. You're not a mercenary. You are a rebel. Curses! Me and my big mouth. What are you gonna do now? I want to help you. Finally. Someone who has the courage to get things rolling. When are you rebels going to strike? Here in Sildan, the orcs are in the minority. And yet Umbrock still rules with an iron fist. He must have something powerful up his sleeve to make them all fear him like that. First, we need to know exactly what it is before we go ahead with the uprising. How about weapons? I saw a lot of them in the mill by the river. Should be about five bundles of weapons. If we had those, it would be a huge step for us. So who's your leader, anyway? My brother, Anog. He's holed up in the woods with a few of his people. Somebody needs to go tell him that we need his help here. I have the weapons that you need. You're a good man. We could really use you here. What about the runaway slaves? The ones that haven't been torn apart by wild beasts are hiding somewhere to the north. Somebody must take them to our refugee camp in the woods near the pass. A fellow named Freeman will take care of them there. Nothing to do? Usually I hunt up in the mountains instead of hanging around here uselessly. Why are you here in the city? I just delivered some of our pelts to the warehouse keeper. Actually, I wanted to go straight home. But somehow, I just can't pull myself together. What do you hunt? Basically everything that lives here on our plains. For that, you sometimes have to be pretty fast and nimble. If you want, I can teach you. But first, you'll have to come with me up to the hunting cabin. Mind your own business. 